Good morning guys, this is Maya. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today in this video we are going to learn a simple trick in which we can create nice 3D models of uh, plants or shrubs. So here I have considered a simple landscape model wherein here I have some landscape area with a tree and this side I have a water body and planter boxes and this is the area where I am going to place some plants, right? So as a so if you have worked before on any landscape or wherein you needed uh, 3D models of plants, you know, you might have experienced that uh, 3D models for plants or trees are too complex. Okay, whatever the plants you get in less than M 1 MB, sometimes the models are good, but sometimes there are some missing parts. Or if the model is good, the poly size is too high, right? which impacts your calculation time now here we are going to learn something in which we do not have to compromise on the visualization of the plants nor on the calculation part okay so let's get started the very first thing you will be needing here uh, is dwg file or any autocad block of 2d or 3d plants okay I have already got one so I have already downloaded one AutoCAD uh, 2D plants and trees DWG file I will show you the link below in the description box you can click there and download it so load the plan open it so here you can see the different blocks of the plants first I'll set the origin somewhere here My AutoCAD file is in millimeters. I will set it in millimeters and finish. For now, I will just move this plan here. Okay. And bring it a little bit down. Okay. Now, now choose any simple CAD block you need to have in your dialogs file. So let's see. Let's go and select some plan which I feel will go with the landscape drawing I'm doing. So I feel something like this, this shops, I can do it. Or I can go with only the upper part of this one, right? Yeah. So, so I have selected this cat block wherein I will be needing only this part, not the stem. So once you are selected with which cat block you need to use to draw go to the objects draw extrusion volume zoom in and you need to only trace out the outer body of this leaves I'm going to draw from here just trace the outer part of this leaf structure you don't have to be very precise but make sure you follow the drawing
so i have completed tracing the outer body of this uh, shirt you can see how it looks okay now this 3d objects here in this dimension is one meter you can make it less you can make it 0.1 okay now this is a plan view but i have my drawing in the elevation form right so i have to view i have to adjust it in such a way that in the dialogues file i have this as a 2d object okay so what i'm going to do is first off the autocad background click on this now adjust this position to say 90 go and check it out your 3d model you can see here it's now in the elevation form in the dialogues file right you can decrease the size 0 0.05 the thickness now go to some textures and add some green to it okay now this looks just like a plain leaf but some it is not something i need model of a plan so what you have to do next is i'll make it closer to my main plan so this is your extrusion volume next step is go to copy and arrange go for copy as a circular arrangement specify anywhere on the drawing the first point and extend it with your mouse okay to say some 0.3 or 0.2 meters okay first click and leave it and here it will show you in the display option to specify the number of quantity you require and let's say we need 15 these kind of extrusion volume to be arranged in a circular form so i'll make it 15 follow curve shape apply and this is how it is looking we'll see it from here and you can see this arrangement right if you want you can align it to x y and z and this is the final look of your 3d model this looks much similar to a shirt if you need you can combine it or you can just make it in a group so i'm going to combine it name it as plant and combine so this is a 3d model of a plant i have created i'm going to use it in my drawing now i want this to be placed somewhere here i think this will be fine so i want this plants to be placed here full completely so what you can do is just select this one go to copy and arrange option copy along a line make the first point second point and assume that you need somewhere five to six these kind of plants to be arranged in a row like this then you can specify a quantity here six follow curve shape apply and here it is and your plants will be arranged in this way right this is in group you can even make it you can even ungroup it and arrange on yourself like i can ungroup this one now it is in single so i can arrange one little front and one little black one little back just random arrangement like this you can follow the same on this side too So this is how it is the final look when you're creating the plant or a show, plant or a show through extrusion volume. I think this looks fine when you're doing a landscape design and you don't want to import 
too heavy so this is guys in this video this is how you can make a 3d model in very just in very simple step all you need is a simple AutoCAD file which I'll be linking below to help you out and and another exciting thing is I'm going to give a giveaway when I reach 500 subscribers so the giveaway will be something which will be very helpful in the dialogues I have already planning on the things and we have almost reached 350 subscribers now and when we hit 500 sub uh, subscribers we are going to have a nice giveaway to all the subscribers so guys if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do subscribe and if you have any doubts any queries any kind of help in the dialogues you will ping me on instagram linkedin or here on youtube and i'll be leaving down my linkedin and instagram accounts link so that you can reach me out thank you for watching this video stay tuned to explore more and dialogues with me thank you